whenever we have something in this form like cosine and sine, um, one of them squared, uh, usually you'll make the u into the thing that's squared. But like I said in the previous video, sometimes it's not going to work. Sometimes you'll have to try something else. But I'm going to say u equals cosine x. du derivative of cosine is negative sine x dx. So dx is equal to du over negative sine x. So we have the integral of u squared sine x du over negative sine x. Those cancel. Remember, you can think of this uh, negative down here as it's, it's 1 over negative 1, which is negative 1. So I'm going to pop a negative 1 out to the front. Got u squared du, negative u cubed over 3 plus c. Um, cosine cubed x plus c. I think taking the derivative of this, that 3 would come down. All right, maybe we should just do that. I'll check. I'll check my work here. Let's see. Um, the derivative of my answer. I'm not going to put in this plus c here because I know the derivative of c is 0. Now the derivative of cosine is negative sine. And so you see now that, let's see, those threes will cancel and the two negatives will become a positive and we get cosine squared x sine x which is exactly that right there. So we know that this is our correct answer.